What's up guys and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Today we are here in Saint Denis and we are going to be meeting a Miss Adler at none other than the saloon. Let's go see what she's up to. I've got a feeling this is going to have something to Don't do with Cole Driscoll. There you are. Here I am. Come on, let's go. Let's go where? And why are you so riled up? Today is a great day, Arthur. Today is the day they are going to hang Colm O'Driscoll. Uh, so? Either they hang him or I shoot him. Oh, they are gonna hang him. Yeah, and not before time. That boy's been on the gallows more than most. I wouldn't count anything until his neck's broke. Well, nor would I. Which is why, despite us being wanted men, we're gonna attend the event ourselves. And follow him onto the scaffold? Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch breathe his last, I think I'd die a happy man. We are gonna disguise ourselves. In this? As in police. This. No way, dude. <laughs> this is too perfect. Okay. Come on. This is an awful idea, but it's also well, really, really don't funny. We just look the part. We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. Mrs. Adler, might I say, being a fancy woman of San Denis shoots you. Huh. I'd dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it meant seeing that son of a bitch swing. <laughs> Colm hung me up. Nearly butchered me. I don't mean I'm comfortable in this woolen coat. You made it out of that predicament, as I remember, Mr. Morgan. My husband weren't so lucky. You lost your husband. I lost my darling Annabelle. That poor boy, Kieran. We've all lost something because of Comb. And that is why we will shepherd him to eternity. Amen to that. Keep those fingers off those triggers, because we'll need cool heads and calm dispositions to see this done. <laughs> Practice what you preach, brother. Whatever do you mean? Are you going to keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all so often now. This doubting and questioning of yours? I miss the old earth. Don't we all? Hey, you two quit it. Y'all got a job to do. We're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it. As far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right, then. Come on. We got a hanging to witness. Look here. Don't the public love an execution? What a crazy time that you could just go and watch them hang somebody. And that was just, like, perfectly normal. Hey. All right, good. Now, you see that pair of assholes? Sure. They're Combs boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. <laughs> I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing at? I don't know. We gotta follow them and find out. Yeah. Oh, here comes somebody. Stay here. Don't do nothing. Go brush that horse, officer. Yes, sir. The crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. I guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey. 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 You know I wasn't going to let it come to that. Well, I guess I don't know what I know no more. And I guess this isn't the time to question either my decisions or yours. Here and now, Colm O'Driscoll's going to get his due. He's turned down there. I like how we're doing better detective police work than the actual police are. Obviously, these guys are planning something. Let's go. Quiet. What does it look like? A bunch of cops. How many? Enough. So what do you think? Paul's up on the roof. Once he starts shooting, we have to have our wits about us and move fast. Yeah. 
I guess we faced worse than this before. Sure. Let's get to it. Yeah. So, they got a guy up on the roof, overlooking the gallows. Find a way up there, on one of these verandas, through a building maybe, and get him. And do it silently. Well, obviously I'm gonna do it silently. I wanna see this bastard swing. All right. So we're gonna find a way onto the rooftop. Oh, Arthur, here's a ladder. Find a way up to the roof and stop it. Gallows, gallows, which way was it? It was over there to the north, right? So he'd be overlooking. Back and looking like we're in Assassin's Creed. These missions are always kind of fun. There's his gun. Do you want me to go down there? Oh! Come on! Your boss is gonna swing. Got him! Welcome. There goes your escape plan. Pick up the rifle and observe the hanging. It is justice that separates us from Barbary. Yet justice itself can at times be barbaric. For sometimes a man is so savage, the only way to deal with him justly is by savagery. Colm O'Driscoll is one such man. Here we go, baby. Murder, torture, robbed, stolen, raped, and abused for a decade across five states, seemingly with impunity. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges. This is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Cole Modriscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. It is not a task we enjoy. But it is a task we must carry out if our civilization is to prosper. Gentlemen, are we ready? Call Modrisk. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Whenever you are ready. <laughs> now you know how it feels to watch somebody you love die. You ruined my life! Oh! Oh! Well, we got him. Let's just get out of here. Go. I can't believe she went haywire and killed those dudes. Dude, that that was something else. Just about blew our cover. We would have been in trouble, but. It's all right, and that's a thorn out of our side for sure. Colmel Driscoll. Officially gone for good. That's good stuff, baby. Now we're back at the camp. We can finally go put our hat on. Well, and we saw the bastard hang okay, but no thing ain't gonna save us. I guess that's one less thing to worry about. I guess compared to the entire government, in the end, 
Como O'Driscoll didn't seem like such a worry. A letter came for you. Oh, okay. I know it's from that Mary. Uh-oh. She ain't worth it, Arthur. Who is? Oh, no. Does she know about our sickness? <gasps> is that a wedding My ring? dear Arthur, you never showed up. And now, after looking at the newspapers, I understand why. I don't imagine you'll receive this letter, but I nonetheless must send it. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. I was just starting to dream the silliest and softest of dreams. I miss you, and I will always miss you. But I cannot live like that. And it seems you cannot live any other way. When I'm with you, the world makes sense, but when we are apart, I see clearly that your world is not a world from which one can escape. I'm so sorry for everything. For everything long ago and for starting up that business again. There's a good man within you, Arthur, but he is wrestling with a giant. And the giant wins time and again. You've broken my heart again. And I fear I have broken yours. And for that, I will never forgive myself. But you must let me go now. I enclose a ring you gave me many years ago. When we were both young. Not because I don't like it, but because I care for it far too much and it reminds me too much of you I hope one day you will find some people in love who can use this for it kept me thinking of you all these years and I hope by returning it to you I can finally be free goodbye Mary dude That makes me really, really sad, dude. What kind of an achievement can you earn from that? What is that achievement for? It just says to complete it. Dude, that makes me so sad. So it's, it's officially over. Like that... She's... No longer our escape plan. She's our past. <sighs> All right, man. We're going to go back. I want to go back to this thing. I missed this hat. The Beaver Big Valley hat. Throw that bad boy back on. Let's see what we're going to get into next. So we've got Micah down here next to the Van Horn Trading Post. Steal the wagon of explosives. Or... We've got Eagle Flies up here. Dutch has convinced Eagle Flies to take action against the military. I kind of feel like we need to go see what's going on with that. That's going to be a big deal. Dude, I... I'm sad. I am truly, really, really sad about Mary. I was hoping we were going to be able to work that out. All right. We're going to go ahead and fast travel to Valentine. And... Uh, Go try to stop this war from breaking out. Let's please not start a war with the army, guys. This does not seem like the the best of ideas. Let's be rational here. So good of you to join us. What's going on? Rebellion. The smell of cordite and integrity. It is a beautiful thing. What are y'all doing? An eye for an eye. We didn't start this, Arthur. They did. We? This ain't our fight. It surely is. Whatever it is you're planning, it ain't a good idea. They want you to fight. Nobody will be killed. We're just going to trap a few of them in the valley, disarm them, tar and feather them, and remind them to leave these boys alone. You have energy for Frank? Come on, Arthur. Just tweaking Uncle Sam's nose a little. I need you to help me. Oh, my goodness. Besides, it's... Perfect. People will see these boys. They won't notice us, and they'll think we're gone. 
Everyone will blame everything on the Indian problem and will disappear up the river. But I don't want to hurt but those guys. That's the problem. We need them in this pass. Help me dynamite up these trees. <laughs> so, you're using them? No, sir. No. Never. But it is mutually beneficial to draw attention to one problem and avail over another. These are good people, but their situation is real complex. We ain't helping them. Sure we are. Come on, let's get this done. Dutch has one person he's worried about, and that's himself. Okay, sorry, Arthur. I'll plant the dynamite. You run the wire. Well, keep lookout. Come up here. didn't always used to be that way either. I feel like he was a really good, brave leader. Like, we weren't the best group of people at the start, but he, like, he... He obviously was self-motivated, but he also cared about the group. And that's, uh... That's quickly changed... recently. So, you finally got to see Colm Hank. Yeah. After all those years, hard to believe. Oh, but it was worth the wait. See? We're tying up the loose ends, Arthur. One by one. It's going to be quite the, the bang, dude. I think that should do it. Come on now, quick. Get back up here. Okay, let's go, Arthur. Let's do it. Hopefully I don't see all this dynamite and the wire on every tree. I feel like it looks a little bit sketch, but I guess if you're not looking for it, you wouldn't really see it. I don't know, it, coming down the hill here, it's it's Bert, pretty obvious. I think I see some movement in the distance. My spotter will let us know when they're near. You want me to push the button? They're coming now. Hot oh, damn. Patrol's a lot larger than we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> Don't worry. That's a good thing. Okay, that's the signal. Here they come. Stay low and quiet. You sure you don't want me to man that plunger, Arthur? No, I got it. Oh, remove the weight of the world from your shoulders for a minute. Like I said, we're just going to give them a bit of a scare. There they are. Looks like more than we thought. It's fine. We're only here to talk and administer a little good old-fashioned humiliation. You're owed that, son, at the very least. Wait for my lead, men. Everyone just stay calm. We've got the upper hand here. There's no way they're not gonna see it. Okay, they've passed the first charge. Put your hands up. You're surrounded. Nobody need get hurt. Your humiliation of us has gone on quite enough. This ain't a good idea. Put down your guns. You are making a mistake, boy. No, you're making a mistake. Put your hands up, soldier. Take a little humiliation and leave these fine folks alone. Who are you? A concerned citizen. Is that so? What oh, now? shoot. You move? No, 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 not quite yet. Soldier, you and your friends gonna tuck tail and run off? Run! Excuse me? I'm getting bored of this. Your friends fired first, soldier! And all of a sudden... Father won't be happy about this! They fired first, son! I'll kill you all! This is ridiculous. There's another patrol in the rear! Go 
I wish there was a way we could have stopped this. I feel bad, man. This is gonna be so bad for their their group and their tribe. Hold their ground! Look out! They're coming up on our left! Yeah, they're flanking. Let's get over here and put a stop to it. Fools, it's the army. It is one regiment of pastry chefs and bullies. Watch your goddamn mouth. All of you, take what you can, and then we move out. Move now. We have to move now. Search these men quickly, then we move. Christ, why aren't we getting out of here? They might have information on them that'll help our friends with their cause. We need anything my father can use to strengthen our case. I ain't sure much is gonna strengthen your case after this. I think you about killed your chances with this little stunt. Find anything? Yes. Some poor fool from New Jersey. These boys ain't the problem. They're only kids. Keep looking. What was that? Shit! Everyone, keep your heads down. Hold on. We're gonna get out of this. Let's stay behind this. Hold on. I want this. Cannons up there, dude. We gotta go take care of that problem. Try to flank them, Arthur. We'll shoot you some space. Yes, we need to take out that cannon. Okay. Up the hill, the cannon. Take out the spotter. Got him. Where's Peta? Damn. We're sending riders from the fort. We need to leave. But where's Peta? Was he killed? He's alive. Well, that went just about according to plan. I'm trying. I'm trying, Arthur, with everything I have, and I will keep trying, and you'll keep doubting me, and we'll keep failing. It ain't like that, Dutch. Look at me. Look at me! I'm just... I'm worried about folk. I know. I... Oh, my God. We should go. Where's Eagle Flash? Run, son! Run! Come on! This area is gonna be crawling with soldiers in a few minutes. We gotta leave. Now! What about Eagle Flash? We gotta go, Arthur. Come on! Let's go, Frank. We need to Come ride on. Hard. Stay with me. These guys are gonna be all over us, dude. This entire tribe is going to be massacred because of that. Look at it. They have every reason to. That was an act of war. Into the trees. Okay, let's dismount here. We won't get the horses down this path. All right, let's carry on by foot. Try and sell them a little snake oil. You think? It's all I got. Get out of here. Yeah. Let's go, buddy. Lose him down here. There you go. You're dead. Shit. I guess. Well. God. Get behind something, Arthur. Everything's gonna be all right. We can deal with these guys. Come on, Arthur. Shot by up top somewhere, I couldn't figure out where it was. 
Our horses definitely could have ridden down this path, bro. Okay. Definitely should have grabbed our shoddy. Let's keep going. Follow the path. It's got to spit us out somewhere. There's a train over there. I don't know if that's going to do us any good. Hold them all. Well, get out of my way so I can shoot him. Come on, Dutch. There's too many Call back. Keep moving, brother. And stop getting in the way of my shots. What does this guy take? What is this? We got a jump. Okay. Okay. Follow my lead. I got a plan. This is a good one. Hello, officers. You keep them hands up and come here. Put your hands up. Hello, Captain. Keep your hands up and come here. Come here. We, uh... We can't do that. Your man... Those men they killed... They were good men. You're fighting nature, Captain. Get over here! Ask my friend here. My whole life, I tried to fight change. It's a waste. I see that. Now, it's waste. You can't fight nature, Captain. You can't fight change. You can't fight gravity. <laughs> and we're alive, baby. We're getting shot at, but we're alive. Dude, what in the world is happening? We're gonna try not to hit all these rocks on our way down. That would be a bad day. Swim left, come on, swim left, swim left. Come on. Come here, big boy. I got you. You're okay. You're okay. What a mess. <laughs> I know. But a mess is what we need. Oh, we just escaped from chaos. Eagle flies must have been taken. Taken or killed. Well, we can't go find out. No, not now. Charles, I'll, we'll send them. Where is he? <coughs> He's probably back at camp. Let's split up. I'll go tell him. You rest up, then go meet him up at the reservation. We are gonna make it, brother. I can feel it. Faith, Arthur. Have faith. More of these weird dreams of this deer. Well, we made it back up here to the reservation. We've got Charles. Thank you for coming. What's going on, bro? 
The chief, he's a... Uh, he's very... Maybe you could speak to him? Yes, yes. Why, well, okay. He's in his tent. Sure. I'll wait for you here. It's just bad news, man. Let's go see what Rain's Fall has to say, but obviously he's not going to be very happy. Hello? Come in. Mr. Morgan. I'm so glad you could make it. How are you? My son. My son is foolish, but he's still my son. I know your son. A little. He's very brave. Very angry. <laughs> he's mean. How is your father? He's dead a long time. He lived a lot longer than was good for any of us. My son probably wishes the same to me. <laughs> I doubt that. I want peace. I need my people to be safe. All my life I've tried to bring peace. But I love my son. They'll hang him for treason. Treason. He is the chief son of a proud nation. How could he commit treason? People who have lied to my people for a hundred years or more. That's treason. Well, Brings up a good point. What should I do? I don't think there's much chance reasoning with Colonel Favor. No. And any chance we had, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, has ensured relations between us and the Army are worse than any point in the last five years. I'm sure he means well. But matters are more complex than he understands. Me and Charles will try and rescue your son. No. Yes, yes. I ain't got much to lose, and you got... I'm doing this. Charles! Where are you? Come on, let's go. I need to get his son back, Here of we course. go. I just ain't sure how. About to embark on the craziest on rescue mission yet? I think there's a way. Follow me. It's being held by the army? This is not gonna be easy, dude. What's up, boy? How you doing? Let's roll out. So, I've been scouting the fort. Dutch is digging the us deeper and deeper. All the main roads and bridges in and out, but if we can get the horses across the river, I found a route that should get us in fairly close. If we wait until late enough, there's a place we should be able to sneak in around the back. Okay, whatever you think. I trust you. No guns, just knives and arrows. If we start making a lot of noise, he'll be dead before we get close to him. Okay. I left two canoes down river in case we need another way out of there. Okay, good. <laughs> Even as a backup plan, that's better than Dutch has ever done for us. He's you know, prepared. this wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for Dutch. It ain't just on Dutch. We all went along with it. He saw Eagle Flies burn hot, and he fanned the flames. He's not helping that tribe, he's helping himself. You see that, or you wouldn't have gone to Rain's Fall behind his back. I guess I just keep thinking. There must be a way to save the situation. To pull Dutch out of the place he's in. Well, I like Rain's Fall. I don't know, Arthur. Rain's Fall is in a tough situation. And that's for Dutch. <sighs> I gotta try. I own that at least. You feel that? There's rain on the wind. I know. Listen, Charles. If it goes bad in there, you get yourself out. Oh, you come on. More to lose. No. Come on. Don't start talking like that. Uh, I didn't tell you before, but I saw a doctor. It's pretty bad. But it's gonna get worse. Oh, Arthur. Any day we can die. Hmm? We're riding to break an Indian chief's son out of a cavalry fort. 
We could both die tonight. In a way, it is a gift to know. In a way, you are lucky. Sure don't feel like that. Yeah, I don't you know about all that, bro. Have time to make amends. The others, Hosea, Lenny, Sean, all them, they didn't. And what about the calendar boys? Both killed trying to escape Blackwater? A more vicious pair of bastards than ever was. And that's all they ever were and will be. Maybe. You're lucky. You got the chance to... to do something better. My guess is maybe that's why you're here now. Either way, just keep your head strong. We're close now. Let me make sure... I've got my bow equipped. It's gonna be the most important you piece right? here. Yeah, I think so. That current's strong. Up here. Follow me. Oh, our horse has been swimming for a while, man. You We're good. Right about the damn rain. Mm hmm Yeah. But might help us with sneaking in there. The rainsfall told me there was some retaliation after the meeting with Colonel Favors. Some women were taken. Elders beaten. Bastards. Yeah. This isn't gonna be nice. There it is. Let's hope we can get him out. Nice and clean. Nobody goes down. I definitely don't want anything to happen to our boy here. Should be fine. Let's get ourselves hidden and wait till it gets dark. Over here. We've broken into Guarma prisons and little work camps out in the boondocks, yes, but this is a whole new ball game. Let's keep quiet. We'll try and find a way in. Main thing is that they don't hear us. You ready? Patrol group. Hopefully we'll be in and out before they can come back around. Let's hurry up then. Let's deal with those two at the gate first. You take one, I'll take the other. We haven't really used this bow a whole lot. We gotta do some more hunting. Okay, let's go. That was close. Kind of bad we have to kill all these innocent people, but I guess you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Let's see what these guys got. At least get some ammo, some gun oil. Alright, that's not bad. Rainbow Six Siege up in this piece. Come on now. Don't go slipping on me. There's a guard coming. You go. 
Charles. All right. Done. Let's go. Good work, homie. Just wanted to see what you could do. Come on. I'm here. Shit. Another guard on the walkway. You want me to get him? Are you taking him? No need to waste an arrow on him. Use your knife. What's up, buddy? Right in the side of the neck, that is rough. Got two guys in front of us. Careful. Two more. One each again. Works for me. Fam, I got him. I've got this one. Turn around on me now. Those are so brutal, dude. Perimeter secure. We'll never get past these guards. Get up that tower and try to distract them. This one right here? Try to put an arrow into the lantern above that stack of wood over there. Start a fire. You should have a clear shot from the walkway up there. Okay. I'm assuming we should take this dude out. Got him. Okay. That lantern right there over the fire. Apparently he killed that guy with a hatchet. I missed it. Keys. You have to get me out of here. We're gonna get you out. I'll check the table out. You search the body. Got, Got the key. I was stuck to the wall. Sometimes you can't get off of it. That would have been a cool kill to see, but keep it at PG-13 here. Come on. <laughs> Your father sent us. My father? He told you to come and kill guards? No, he didn't say that, Ian. Of course not. You okay? Sure. Enjoy being tortured. Clears the mind. If you say so. Uh, whoa, whoa. Uh, uh, I'm fine, I'm fine. Oh, no. Well, we are going to be able to go out as silently as we came in, that's for sure. sneaking out of here. Yeah, we got the prisoner. We got Let's that right. Now. Got him. Watch out, 
Loom, come on, baby. There it is. We're good. I'm going to blast the Just push up. That was sexy, that little slide. Go down. Guys up there. We're good. Not just climb out of here? Would you? Yes, but how? Destroy the wall. Do we have any dynamite? Ah. Uh. What about that cannon? Okay. Or we can just use our dynamite. Come on. Let's go, baby. And our horses are here. One single guy running at us. Funny. I hear more on the way though. I hit some canoes down by the river. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Look out! We got more on our tail. It's only guys. See, unfortunately. Oh, oh yes. Road on the left. Road on the left. Oh, come on. You're ahead of us. Quick, down this way. He's down. Come on, Captain. Of course, just run along with him, please. You're doing a good job. The canoes are close. Yeah. They're still behind us, though. They're right on us, Arthur. Do something. Hold them off. I'll give you supplies to the canoes. Come on. Come on, baby. That's two down. Get in here. Oh, thank you, friend. Y'all better hurry up. Like your life depends on it. Let me get this last guy. He's down. Why'd y'all put me in my own canoe? This isn't fair. We made it this far. Let's get out of here. Don't pay for this. Don't wish they killed me when they had a chance. Let's just give you the safety of us, my friend. It's like Dutch said. They only have power. Dude, they know we're using the canoes. Watch out for the current. This is some swell. Watch yourself. Last one. Got him. Me, that ain't my plan. Got him. You're lucky I'm a good shot, y'all. You're lucky I have a good pistol. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go right now. We're good. Dude, this pistol is one of our best weapons in this game. The bloom. Closes so quick. They won't give up easily. Stay ready. It's so accurate. This is the same river we just jumped in not too long ago. At least we know it. Oh, guys behind us already. Too old for this man. I think we lost him. Come on. 
You okay, Arthur? We lost our hat. Yeah, I'm right as rain. How are you? <clears throat> I'll be fine in a day or so. I heal fast. Colonel Favors won't be too happy with your rescue. I guess not. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot more trouble. My father. Even he may have to fight. You won't win. No big fight with them. Shouldn't y'all just run away? Where would we go? I don't know. I'm fine. Let me take you back to your father. Hmm? <sighs> Thank you. No mind. Yeah. You all right, Arthur? He does not sound good. There's a random horse here. I guess we'll ride you for now. Yep. Until yeah. we find ours. Frank looks like he might be up the hill to the right. Maybe he's just hanging out. He's up here. Yeah. What's up, buddy? Yep. Well, what else can we do, boys? Um, if we go back to camp, we've got a Sadie mission. Sadie wants to speak with us. I guess that's going to be our best option. All right, so we uh, we cleaned up a little bit, I shaved, got our hat back, and uh, now we're going to go see what Mrs. Adler is up to. You okay, friend? I'm really not. Never better. I'm really not. Gosh. You're breaking his heart. You know that. Did he tell you to say this to me, friend? No. <laughs> but I know. Dutch and that fool at his ear. They're gonna kill every last one of us. I see that now. Becoming more self-aware. I really hope there's not a problem with Sadie. She's Sadie. always been one of my favorites, dude. She you better okay? not be leaving. Peach. You sure? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? The whole goddamn place full of people bickering, fighting, and lying. It makes me real sad. I know. I need someone to ride with me. Do what? Finish off them of Driscoll's. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. I don't have it in me no more. I saw a calm swing. I, I just don't care. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me and to my husband. Like you're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. I'm down. I'll tell you what. I'll do it. But there's something you could help me with. Abigail. Jack. John. Make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes... Or how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean, help them escape when I... You know, you and me, we're more ghosts than people. But them, they, they could... I know. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? Let's go. Thanks, Arthur. Okay. Come on. I don't really have the hate in my heart for these guys anymore. I feel like we're kind of over that, but... Uh, she's going to close the chapter on her end, and I guess we'll help her out. Keeps alluding to his death, man. Like, I got. I 
really don't like this. I know it's inevitable. But I just don't want to see it happen. <clears throat> Fine morning for a killing. Huh. Hi. You seen anything down there? Yeah, I think there's a bunch of them down there. I'm mostly drunk. For one of them, it's a fat fellow with a beard. Him? He's mine. Okay. Well, let's go get this done then. It's a big ranch. Run down. Lots of folk there. But spread pretty thin. I'll set it off and then we'll... We'll take it from there. Take it from there? Okay. So, no real plan then. Oh, I got a plan. Now, come on. Sounds like a Dutch that mission. Woman? Jesus. Who the hell is that lady? That's the Hellcat saw Combs swing. Now, let's finish this. Here we go. Oh, she's going off, dude. She's got the shoddy, too. I'm jealous. I wish we would have thrown that in our satchel. We gotta start hitting our shots, boys. That guy was on fire. I'll push up with you. He's down. Sounds insane. Come on, baby. We're okay. Don't shoot the fat bearded guys. The lady outside don't want none of you coming out of here. Who missed their shots? Gonna enjoy seeing you poking. I think that's everybody in here. Clear. Okay. Into the now don't get too crazy, Sadie. Wait for me. Let's not. That was brutal. Sounds like she may have found him. Rubbing herself in his blood. Yeah. He was a good man, my Jakey. We was always sweet on one another. I'm sure. Yeah. I miss him every day, every moment. Oh, they turned me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him, they still pure. I ain't even got that. Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> We, uh, we should get away from her. Yeah. 
I'm happy for her. She got her, her redemption. I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, might want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur. <sighs> All right, guys. Well, it looks like our next mission is gonna be with, uh, with Micah. We're gonna be stealing that dynamite for our last big heist, so it's gonna be a pretty crazy day. Hope you guys are excited for that next. Drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, I'll see you guys later.